I'm currently in Coventry city centre. I've just finished work. The time is 20 past five. It takes about half an hour to get home. I'm probably going to get home just in time for kickoff. We never do it easy. First game of the season. I'm going to do the intro when I get home because I'm in a bit of a rush. But half an hour, 40 minutes till kickoff. First game of the season. I'm in a rush. We never do it the easy way on Villa on tour. But um, let's get home. Watch the football. First game of the season. Come on, the Villa boys. I'm in a rush. We need to go. Come on, the boys. Morning fellas, welcome back to another Villa on Tour video. You can probably tell by the light, it's a little bit late. I'm filming this at half time. You would have seen just then, uh, I was a little bit struggling for time. You'll see in a minute that I walked into watching the game about seven minutes in, so that's not ideal. But I'll do the intro now. Sheffield United at home, you know the drill. First game of the season at Villa Park. Now, massive, massive shout out to Luke1977 because it's not just any old Max20 today. Max25 for 20% off. If you buy anything on Luke Roper1977, the website, Website, put the code in at checkout max25 and it will get you a massive 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 25% off that is off anything as well for sale items whatever max25 will get you 20% 25% off that will run for one day only but I, I don't know when you're watching this but it goes live at nine o'clock on the Monday which is when the game is today 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 um, and it'll run for 24 hours so max25 25% off anything on Luke a massive massive chance to get yourself a decent bargain there so link in the description hop over there and of course, massive shout out to OneFootball as well. The best footballing app out there. Now football is underway for Villa and everyone in the Premier League. Everyone in the lower leagues, the Carabao Cup seems to be on every other day at the moment. So OneFootball is the app for you. You need to download that for all of your football needs as well. Transfer news is going on. News in Europe, football, anything, anything football. OneFootball has got you covered. So download that link in the description as well. That is free. But yeah, like I said, I'm filming this at half time. So um, let's get into the game for you lot. And uh, yeah, up the Villa. Right, we're seven minutes in. I've only just sat down. Apologies, everyone. Anything happened? No. No, calm, okay. Um, we had a shot on, uh, well, just shot on target. Yeah, Watkins starts, uh, Cash starts, decent team, Trezeguet starts, no sign of Troy or Ray. Um, news coming out today, though, means to sign a new contract till 2024. I don't know. Prediction 1 um, 1, I said, but I reckon it'll be a cagey game. If we're going to win, it'll be 1 0. I don't see too many goals. Um, you've seen the amount of goals this weekend has been ridiculous so it wouldn't surprise me if this is nil-nil I think it's got a draw in all over it my mate Trezeguet starting new season same old love for Trezeguet you've got to give it to him can you mention their strip because it is absolutely appalling it's like a white <laughs> pink they look like a 11 <laughs> running around the pitch you can't say that oh my god yeah they're in a <laughs> go on Ollie ref oh, man ref what Sorry, he stopped him getting to the... He stopped him getting... Sorry. Oh, he sent him off! Wait, what? He's got the red card out. Yeah. Is he sent... Oh! He, he said... Is that John Egan? He sent John Egan off. I said it, mate. He was still on goal. He's still on goal. He's yeah. pulled him back. Yeah. Sorry. You can't complain. We saw a similar thing yesterday in the Chelsea game. Obviously, he didn't quite get rugby tackled like Mane did. But I'm sorry. If you foul him and he's still on goal, it you can't all complain. All over it. That's disgusting. Sorry. Red card. I'm not having anything. That's a fair decision, mate. He's still on goal. He stops him getting to the ball when he's in on goal. Yeah. Red card. Mm. Damn. Ah, well, that's not good. Yeah, decent counter attack. They looked at it like at three angles here. This might get overturned. Uh, yeah, oh, I'll tell you what. Oh, no, yeah. no, it's a penalty. Yeah, yeah, it's his foot on his yeah, yeah, yeah. shoe. Yeah, it's a penalty. Oh, he oh, saved it! Oh, Martinez on his debut! Oh, what a bloke! What a sign in! He was worth every penny. Yeah, that's a quality save. I mean, it's, it's a comfortable height, but oh, Martinez. That's why you spend the big bucks on a goalkeeper. What a save! Oh, it's our day. It's our day. Wilder, keep crying. He hates it coming to Villa Park. Oh, come on. Cheers to you, Emmy Martinez. Cheers to you. Oh, my God. Yeah. 
Right, okay, so half time whistle has gone. Nil nil, quite an eventful half. John Egan gets sent off 12 minutes in, and you think, right, Villa's chance. This is Villa's game to lose. Um, we looked decent after the red card, you know, the initial 5 10 minute spell. We looked like we could cause a threat. Um, had a few corners, etc. Um, but we didn't really cause too many problems to Aaron Ramsdale, I think he's in goal. Not too many shots on target. We're getting in and around the box, but not doing too much with it. And then after that, Sheffield United grew into the game, which wasn't ideal. They had a decent counter-attack, won themselves a penalty. Clumsy from Matt Target. Like I said, it was a really good counter-attack and we were just caught sleeping a little bit. Um, it was a penalty after watching it a few times. Martinez, what a bloke. Incredible save. It was a decent height for him, but he does so well to get across and save that. So credit to the debutant Martinez. Um, going into the second half, Sheffield United, like I said, will settle for the point. I think it's going to be a really, really tough game. I think the longer the game goes on, Sheffield United will be happy with the nil-nil, but we're going to have to work our socks off to get any, like, three points from this game. I think a point is most likely. My prediction is still nil-nil, uh, maybe 1-1. One, one. Um, but yeah, if we can get three points here, I think we have to because, like I said, they've got ten men. So um, big, big chance for Villa. Hopefully we can get over the line and get the three points. On to the second half. Come on, you Villa boys. We're underway, second half. Ezri considered his hamstring coming out for the second half somehow. Doesn't look himself, not great. He's feeling it, doesn't look good. Um, but we'll crack on, no changes. And start the second half well, to be fair, five minutes in. Um, we're on the front foot. I think we're going to see this for the majority of the second half. Sheffield United, they're going to sit deep. It's, it's up to Villa to unlock them and find a goal out of somewhere, man. But they look so defensively organised. Approaching the hour mark, it's, it, we've probably had 90% of the ball in the second half. I think it goes from target to Louise to cash to Louise to tie. They're just switching it around. We've had all of the ball, we're just not exactly doing anything with it because it's so hard to get through the Sheffield United back four or five, whatever it is. Um, they'll sit back, it'll be like this for the rest of the game. It's going to take a bit of quality if we're going to get anything out of this. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, it's so tight. Oh, corner ball! Get in! Yes! Hey! S3 Concer! Come on! Knee slide! Where's that hamstring, mate? Yeah, who needs a hamstring? S3 Concer <laughs> doesn't need a hamstring. In the same goal that Sheffield United were crying about. They tweeted early saying something about that goal. Mate, S3 Concer just scores in there. What a header, son! <laughs> Bang, flick on from Ty. The centre backs combined. Ramsdale scrambling. S3 Concer scores. Come on! We deserve that. We, we, I mean, Ramsdale hasn't had to do a fat lot, but we've had most of the ball. We deserve that goal. Come on, Villa. Do we carry on attacking? I don't know, but that is a massive goal. Massive, massive, massive goal. Dino loves it. Cheers to you, Esri. Come on. It's a long walk back for Horahan. That's the goal, man. I doubt you have. Yeah, I doubt it cares. <laughs> Master stroke from Dean Smith's tricky villains. Come on. Sheffield United. They have to come out and play some sort of game to get anything. So does that open them up at the back for a Villa second? I don't know, I don't know, it'd be interesting. Hit it Jack! Hit it Jack! Oh, I couldn't get his feet. Oh! Oh, I thought it was in! <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh, that would be so perfect if Jack scored, man. Quick shout out to Luke as well, already mentioned it before the game, but max 25 for 24 hours only gets you 25% off. So check that out, link in the description. Max 25 for 25% off of the Luke. Ollie Watkins, Ollie Watkins, Ollie Watkins, Ollie Watkins, Ollie Watkins! Oh my god. I thought that had nestled, yeah. mate. I thought that had nestled up the bins. Oh, Ollie Watkins creates a bit of space and he goes for that top corner. You can see what he's gonna do. Oh, I thought that was in. Jack, 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 Jack! Oh, you. Oh, it's deflected over, man. That could have gone anywhere. That would have sealed it. Oh well, there's literally 90 seconds left. It would have been nice to get a second, especially for Jack, but oh. Oh well, boys. Oh, there's a second ball on the pitch. Full time whistle, come on. 1 0 to the tricky villains. Get in. Final result then 1 0. Martinez is praying. He and Concert are the heroes. If you didn't save that penalty, we wouldn't have gone on to win this game, let's be honest. Um, Sheffield United, they're a stubborn side. I think they'll be alright this season. I don't think they'll do as well as last season. Um, but still, they're a defensively decent side. Chris Wilde has gone straight down the tunnel. He's a not a happy boy. But um, fair play, Dean Smith. He set us up well. We look at we look the dominant side, let's be honest. First and second half. 100% um, the dominant side, I think. Matty Cash and Watkins did alright on their debuts. Watkins wasn't quite... You know, he didn't have too many chances in front of goal. But his movement's good. He had a few half chances. 
Um, defensively, clean sheet as well, you can't complain. Watkins, no, uh, Mings and Konza classed at the back, obviously. Mings with the assist to Konza's goal. Yeah, defensively good. Target okay, cash good. Um, so yeah, we've sorted out the defence. Three points to start the season, you can't complain. Clean sheet again, can't complain. Fulham uh, next week away from home, I believe, on Monday, 6 o'clock, the same time. Um, another three points there would be fantastic. Um, and yeah, hopefully it won't be another relegation battle this season. It'll be a more comfortable season, uh, but we shall see. Thank you very much for watching this video. Massively appreciate it. If we can hit 1,500 likes, that'll be massively appreciated. Max 25 for 25% off Luke. You know what to do. Download OneFootball, and I'll see you in the next one. Up the villa.